essentially what the Pioneer Institute is, which is what the Marine Corps is, which is a force multiplier, uh, showing just what a small group of people can, can accomplish. I, I am pleased to be invited here. I think I was invited because of my new book, The Conservative Sensibility, and nothing says conservative sensibility like Boston. Uh, <clears throat> But one of, one of the, uh, one of the <clears throat> canonical texts of American conservatism as it began its post-Second World War revival had the title, Ideas Have Consequences. A long life in and around politics has convinced me that only ideas have large and lasting consequences. And Pioneer is in the business of bringing ideas to bear on problems to the extent that Pioneer Institute and other state-based think tanks are working to keep America dynamic, to maintain confidence, not just in the rationality, but the ultimate equity of a market society of spontaneous order as opposed to a government-centered society, then it is in institutions like this that the future of America is simply going to be decided. <clears throat> 